Before we get into the enhancements for SOLIDWORKS Visualize 2023, I wanted to point out a few useful settings. I usually use Visualize in dark mode, and it tends to make it a little easier to view, especially on things like projectors. To adjust the mode, navigate to Tools, Options, User Interface, and then select Dark or Light Mode. I'll set this to the dark mode. Another useful setting is under the 3D viewport. You can scroll down to maximize the resolution and choose a different size. Fill window is a useful option for when you're reviewing your model, like in this demo. You can also tweak the keyboard shortcuts for a few tools to streamline the process of switching back and forth from the selection and manipulation tools. Pressing F12 opens the keyboard shortcuts, which is good to know anyways. You can add a preset, name it whatever you want, and for this example, I'll search for Next. And then I'll change the Next Transform mode to use the S key. It will prompt that it's already assigned, which is okay since the changes are only for this preset. I'll also scroll down and find the Next Selection mode, and I'll change that to use the A key, except the same warning. Now I can cycle through the selection modes one by one by pressing the S key. And likewise, I can now cycle through the manipulation modes by pressing the A key. This is going to help limit my movement from the graphics area to the menu to only turn it on or off, not have to cycle through all the options. I can just use the shortcut keys. So now let's take a look at the SOLIDWORKS Visualize 2023 enhancements. There's no more effective way to share your ideas than with eye-catching graphics, and there's no faster way to create them than with SOLIDWORKS Visualize 2023. Visualize has set the bar for creating incredible graphics from your CAD models, and for this release, the whole process just got even easier. Enhancements in Visualize 2023 start from the beginning of the process. Selecting an import option is an important step that sets your project up for success. Visualize 2023 improves this process by filtering the most relevant options for SOLIDWORKS files. This simplifies our decision to a single question. Do we want the individual control that component part body provides or the convenience of grouping all same appearances into a single part? The component part body option works in similar fashion to the automatic mode of past releases, but has been updated for this release with one important difference. This import option now mimics the SOLIDWORKS assembly structure while retaining appearance control in Visualize. This is an ideal situation as Visualize users can take better advantage of groupings such as subassemblies already defined in the SOLIDWORKS model. Putting your designs in context can go a long way in immersing your viewer in your world. Visualize has always been able to take advantage of nearly any kind of geometry you can get your hands on. In 2023, we'll see that the standard import options are still available for any non-SOLIDWORKS files, such as this GLTF file. It's common practice to improve performance by making use of preview mode while setting up your scene, especially if it involves complex or high detail models. However, this can result in a lack of feedback on how your setup is interacting with the lighting. In Visualize 2023, the handling of PBR material previews has been improved, providing a much better idea of how light will react with roughness maps, alpha transparency, and other characteristics. We see light from the HDR glistening off the wet spots of our trail model, allowing us to be much more confident in our setup while still enjoying the performance benefits of preview mode. Any advanced PBR options such as height maps will be added on top when rendering resumes. A common use case for rendering is to create an arrangement of colors showing a variety of potential color options. Visualize is packed with efficiency tools for this kind of work. As it always has, the Appearance Import option groups all same appearances into a single unit. Likewise, a quick pattern creates an array of geometry ready with little effort. Previously, it was a bit more time consuming to track down all the necessary colors, codes, swatches, and references, and then trying to match them all and visualize. With a dramatically improved color picker, this is likely now the easiest part of the process. With this update, we can bring in colors from nearly every source you could think of. A dedicated tab for color palettes has been added along with a few default palettes. Custom palettes can be imported directly from SOLIDWORKS from an Adobe ACO file, a logo as a vector file, or from a web page CSS or HTML file. Whatever you have access to, you'll be able to extract company or project specific colors directly in Visualize. Once imported, you'll have full control over your palettes as well. Searchable names are present and the swatches can be applied immediately. 
The color dialog now unlocks and remains available for subsequent actions until it's closed. In cases where the colors are not available to be imported, they can be added in similar fashion to previous releases. On the Color tab, color can be selected with a graphical display and the Hue slider is now present in RGB as well as HSV. The ability to simply paste a hex code has now been added, as well as CMYK definition for print applications. As always, the color picker itself can be used to select a value anywhere on your screen, and its color preview has been enlarged for greater accuracy while selecting. With a color chosen, we can add the swatch to our palette and lock the palette to prevent any further changes. Palettes can be exported as a shared asset across users or imported back into SOLIDWORKS so the accurate colors can be applied into the design phase. The previous eight color selections will also remain in recent colors across all sessions. This dramatically enhanced color management system ensures that your exact color is never more than a click away. The color matched appearances are now ready to be applied to the pattern, and the Appearance Import option provides a single drag replacement of all bodywork appearances. With the scene set, it's time for final renders. Visualize 2023 introduces a new rendering engine with the Stellar Physically Correct option. This enhancement sets up Visualize for a future of exciting new features and tighter integration with the entire portfolio of products. This release brings many enhancements that are guaranteed to reduce the time it takes to produce engaging content for sales, marketing, websites, and social media campaigns. The time has never been better to bring your CAD models to life than with SOLIDWORKS Visualize 2023.